I think what surprised me the most with this flying car research is that there is a niche role that they can play in a sustainable mobility ecosystem. The students actually led our study. They, they were responsible for doing the modeling, the interpretation of results, and they were the lead authors on our nature communications paper. So for me what was really cool was the opportunity to combine what I learned at school, uh, which is conducting sustainability assessments with having impact on an emerging technology. For me personally to have the chance to do an internship and a research study on something like flying cars is very exciting. At SEAS we create opportunities for our students to collaborate directly with uh, industry such as Ford Motor Company in this case and also be involved in interdisciplinary problems. We have people from all sorts of different countries on our team. We have people from India, Korea, uh, the UK, America. The University of Michigan is, is a hub for all things new mobility. Um, M-City is really renowned in the space for what it's doing with connected and automated vehicles. The research that I've been involved with here at the University of Michigan has definitely shaped my career path. I've been doing research in collaboration with Ford Motor Company over the last three years where I've analyzed the sustainability implications of connected and automated vehicles and now flying cars. Flying cars are really in the infant stages of development. So there's, there's so much to be done, so much work to be done, uh, so many new perspectives and so much creativity you can have in this space. We drove I-94 every day into work over the summer. Um, there was a lot of traffic on 94. Uh, it would be really nice if we could zip across uh, over top of I-94 on our way from Ann Arbor to Detroit.